Rates for Colorado Springs Utilities customers are going up again the second time since January. The increases take effect March 1st. That's Saturday. They'll mean the average customer will pay $1.38 a month more for electricity and $1.70 a month more for natural gas. Carity on News Channel 13, Scott Harrison is tracking the impact of these utility increases, and he has reaction. He's live outside Spring City Hall tonight. Scott. Well, Heather, the rates and rate increase in January that you mentioned were told by Springs Utilities factored in higher operational costs for the system. Now, today's rates, as approved by the city council, are based solely on higher fuel costs. And that's important because 90% of the power generated by Springs Utilities comes from either burning coal or natural gas. Now, at first, and council members talked about this issue extensively this afternoon before voting. At first, council members thought about possibly delaying their vote for a month or so. The reason is because fuel prices have been fluctuating so much that some council members thought that maybe in a month or so, prices would stabilize and there would not be a need for charging customers higher rates. But others on the council said that the longer that they waited to raise rates, the worse of a situation they might be in if prices continue to fluctuate. I have received I don't know how many emails. People just cannot afford it. And they wonder why we always increase rates, we increase this, we would never do any cuts. The supply of market has gone down for two reasons. It's gone down because there's a higher demand because of the cold weather in the Northeast. And it's also gone down because in the cold weather it's harder to get the gas out of the ground. Now, Springs Utilities says it has a good reason for not wanting to wait on this rate increase. Springs Utilities says without this rate increase, they could be in a $20 million deficit by the end of the year. Now, some council members said that they really wish that they could get stable rates for customers who are tired of utility rate increases. But still, Springs Utilities says even with this increase, rate prices are still relatively cheap compared to other places. Today's vote, the council voted seven to two, both on raising electric rates and on the natural gas rates. We're live outside Spring City Hall tonight. Scott Harrison, KRDO, News Channel 13. Scott, thanks. And on that same theme, the CEO of Colorado Springs Utilities will not get a six-figure raise. City Council shot it down in a razor-thin vote. That vote was five to four against the big raise for Jerry Forte. The raise would have been $171,000, bringing his salary to nearly $450,000 a year. Supporters say even with the raise, Forte's salary still would have been 25% less than the market pays for his position. But opponents say such a sizable raise just doesn't look good, especially utility rate increases and those going up on Saturday. Council members saying they're willing to find other ways of compensating him.